Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So if you're new here, be sure to hit that subscribe button so that you don't miss any future updates. And if you're enjoying the content, be sure to smash that like button because that really goes a long way into helping me. So for this trip, we decided to go to Prague for the Christmas season. And then I just wanna take you guys along with me so that you see what Prague looks like and then you can also just get ideas of what you can expect to do should you plan a trip to Prague so let's get into it so the moment we just wait in here because trip supervisor made us to come in early an hour early so what <laughs> Can we come later? I wouldn't have bumped into that man. Yeah, yes, right. Yeah. Ah. So because she made us to come here so early, she was busy bumping into blind people oh, yeah. and blocking their way. So rude. Yeah, so just waiting for our train to at least arrive so we can see what platform it's at. Uh, yeah. So yeah, just basically going to clean this up because we know y'all get freaky in these cabins. So... Pro tip always tr start off with that because you know, if you come here with like a black light yeah you might not want to see your food is sitting on this i hope they give us food yo uh, what is this <laughs> they don't give food So at the moment, so I don't know what time it is. Why is this funny? Why should go somewhere else? At twenty past seven. You mean go to another testing center? Twenty past seven, and we are nowhere near. That's what it is. So far, we have left Slovakia. I think we're in Czech Republic now, but in a different part. Uh, I don't remember the, the name of the last one. But I think we're gonna pass somewhere by Bruno or Bruno. I don't even know how they pronounce it because there's no. Kind of what do you call it? Vowel. Yeah. There's no vowel. Okay, the, there's only one vowel at the end. How do you pronounce B R N O? Bruno. <laughs> yeah. So these are some of the pre ticket options that you get. I don't know what half price this. Oh, Prague and suburbs. We're not going to no suburbs. So basically, this is where we're gonna be staying. Yeah, so it's just a standard room. You know, again, full body mirror. If you wanna check yourself out in the morning. Is this thing recording? Okay, yeah. Um, what is this? So in here, this is the bathroom, which is, you know, standard bathroom. Sink, toilet, uh, shower. Yeah, there's no bidet this time, because I think that's just a Western Europe thing. I don't know. Again, more mirrors, because gotta stay clean in these streets, my guy. Um, yeah. And then, where's the light? Hey, gotta conserve electricity, pen. Um, and then this is the room itself so we have a little kitchenette area which is like yeah it's pretty stacked oh is that, is that light Ooh, okay that is awkward um okay i don't think it gets any brighter but there's a stove there sink cabinets with like yeah, everything that you need utensils oh and then morning stuff Washing machine, I don't know why it's in here. Um, and then yeah, that's, that's the rest of the room. I've got cupboards, if you wanna be one of those people. The TV, oh, and entertainment. Oh damn, they got books in here. Hey bro. Yeah, he can be like Leonard and stuff. Ish, guys, it's, wait. 
Where's my hair? Because I think they need to illuminate some stuff, because yeah. Anyways, got books, some deco, I don't know. Oh, there's like some reading material for tourism and stuff. Um, yeah, TV, and then the rest of the room. So we just arrived and I think, yeah, we're just gonna try to get some rest and uh, call it a night. We'll probably see, yeah, then we'll see or we'll start exploring tomorrow morning. On the tube. <laughs> and wow, that's a big ass toe. Damn. Anyways, yeah, so we climbed up to the National Museum. It is magnificent. So, so right now we just left the National Museum and we are in front of I really don't know how to pronounce this monument because it is written in Czech but I'll be sure to check the English translation and um, right now I'm just going to walk down to try see the uh, what is it the Christmas market which is happening down here and then after that we'll then go catch the metro um, yeah, to see where else to go the weather is quite beautiful it's a bit cold but you know it's not enough to uh, force a snake to run into like a hole or anything like that that's not bad like it's really okay i did want to try the kebab avocado i'll take a kebab like uh the on the skewer oh yeah i can go try it <laughs> oh from eating earlier yeah. ah yes oh, yeah and then you can just come here and like see abu nguenyama and the squad hmm So we just kind of walked into this TM mall and came across this statue, I think it's called, yeah, well, hanging glass. <laughs> um, yeah, we actually kind of found it by accident because we're trying to find this museum of something. Uh, yeah, it's quite interesting. Oh, oh, this is just giving me tropophobia right now. But yeah, we are at this national, what? Okay, I don't know how to pronounce this, but Museum of um, Illusions. But unfortunately, it is closed. Made our crayons. It is closed because, yeah, today is just not a day for much of that. Ooh, wow. So normally, um, from what I read online, and that also explains why there were so many tourists here, because this head is supposed to rotate, I think every hour or every 30 minutes, I forgot. But then when we got here, it was broken, <laughs> and so we were just out here looking like fools, waiting for this head to rotate, and it never did, which was very anticlimactic. I think one of the most interesting things that I found about Prague is how it has all these little pockets where you can kind of, you know, take a peek or a peep and you'll find some old building which probably has some history to it and I don't know, I find those kind of hidden gems interesting and honestly, like, we all come to Europe to be able to appreciate the old architecture and, uh, you know, Prague will not disappoint you in any way with giving you all these old buildings. Uh, hey, it's up, it's up, it's up. <laughs> 
Ari, F1, F1. I have some stuff for you. Come. Okay, what is on? So basically, you can come here and. Um, nice, okay. Then you have to pay for the thing. Oh wow, this is so graphical. <laughs> I'm burning. Oh, I'm burning. Look, that's why it is. The salt. Oh. Oh my god. Just this whole square. Yeah, like this whole square just looks amazing. Like, what is this? And then that is the astronomical clock which is said to be the most accurate oh my god wow it's such a nice christmas tree what this is such a nice christmas tree yeah and then wow I, i'm in love with this like this is a vibe this is a whole vibe so the reason you saw that countdown is because every hour there's this little show <laughs> that happens at, at the astronomical clock where I want to say it's Jesus and the 12 disciples if I remember well. So you can go there then just see it every hour. I mean <laughs> it also like don't expect anything past what you're seeing here because we kind of thought there might be a lot more happening but it was also just quite interesting to see. I will try to find a way to be to get like behind uh, in front of that thing. Uh, where are these people? Oh. Um, yeah, now we just want to see if we can get a picture in front of this Christmas tree, which is so dope. I think there's an observation deck that you can go up uh, but being like Christmas season and whatnot yeah I think it's close for today so there's that so this is actually where we ended our first or off official first day or day two because um, we don't want to exhaust all the attractions in one day because I mean Prague is quite big but at the same time what you'll notice is that a lot of the things are in uh, close proximity so yeah and then so we just wanted to have a more chilled more relaxed pace of exploring the city and that's why you know we're not trying to rush it uh, we're just trying to enjoy being there and plus it was the christmas season so you know why rush things so if you did enjoy this video be sure to hit that like button don't forget to subscribe and turn on those notifications and tell your friends about it